hey what is up today guys I have just made an electric gun it is the bomb comment in below if you want me to make a tutorial on how to make it this is what it looks like it is just so this is the breakdown of it first I will go over the materials needed so you need a spray bottle some kind of handle I use two shotgun shells and my brother from my brother because he's in trap um a sparker from a stick lighter when you pull it if you see that spark by those two um wires you need some electrical tape hot glue and then you're gonna need any kind of ammo that fits in this tube for me i just used a cut toothpick some electrical tape and a q-tip and the way to load it this i'm not responsible for anything that you do with it do not point it at people. I cannot stress that enough. Do not point it at anything with a heartbeat. To load it, you take a, what's it called? A Q-tip? I That's what I think it's called. I'm not sure. You put a little bit of hairspray on it. So you take it, you go, so it's wet, and then you put it inside and then roll it around. Make sure it does not touch the wires. That will make it not work. You push it around, you screw the cap on. You screw the cap on super tight. You put the ammo in the hole, and then you pull the trigger a couple of times. The th one thing that I was surprised of, and you gotta like, you can't just spray it in. I've tried so many different ways. You have to swab it in. Otherwise, it does not work. And also, parent supervision is not advised. It is needed to make this or even shoot it. So that's pretty cool. I will do it. And then a fast, just a regular motion of it shooting and here we go so we're in the bathroom you're gonna need some hairspray make sure your parents know about this my parents know they know that i made this and they have approved it or not approved it just said that i can do it okay so you're gonna take a fresh new q-tip you are going to put it over the sink and then spray the tip with it so it's nice and wet. So you take your wet and q-tip, you unscrew the lid, and then you take this, put it in, and just roll it around, making sure that it does not touch the wires. Roll it around there, then you screw the tap on, cap on as tight as it will go, and it is ready to load. Actually, I will go like that. Now that was pretty cool. Parent supervision. I cannot stress that amount as much as I can. My parents know that I'm doing this.